Just put that down. <laughs> <laughs> I'll teach you. Howdy folks, Jim Gum here. Welcome to the channel and welcome to Sea of Thieves. As you can see here, this is the beginning. Uh, it's another scale test they're doing. They're probably going to do a few of these leading up to the eventual release at the end of this month. And this is your select a pirate. Choose a character to represent your adventures. On your journey towards becoming a pirate legend, you'll be able to customize your chosen character with clothing, hairstyles, beard styles, eye patches, hooks, peg legs, equipment, and weapons. Now, if you see the picture there, there's two sets of three different pirates. The bottom one, there's no different clothes on them, no tattoos, no facial hair or anything like that. And you look at the ones at the top, it just goes to show you the kind of clothes, the eye patches, the facial hair, the tattoos that you'll be able to start getting while you're in game. So let's have a look at this. Now, this is called the IPG, the Infinite Pirate Generator. So... Basically, this is on a carousel. Oh, or should I just look around first? It's on a carousel. What you do is just swing around, looking for the pirate you like the looks of, and you pick that pirate. But that is going to be your pirate for the, the future of the game. Even though you will be able to update clothes and facial hair and tattoos and peg legs and hooks and all that while you're in game, this isn't the kind of character customization I'm used to, I prefer the more in-depth character customization where you've got sliders and you can choose from you know, different hairstyles, different facial features, body types, things like that. But I don't like any of them. But basically you can just probably sit here for hours. Oh, I like the looks of her. She's pretty cool. He's not bad. Yeah, what I was saying is um, I don't really like the the sort of way they're doing it. I prefer the traditional character customization. I mean, doing it this way as well, I mean, say I liked her and I thought, oh yeah, she's not bad. But what I would like to do was probably I've seen before. Oh dear, I like her as well. What I'd like to do is maybe sort of temporarily pick that one. And then maybe temporarily pick that one. And maybe temporarily pick that one. And, um, Go through another few different carousels, see what other pirates there is there, and maybe get a, I don't know, a group of, say, up to ten that you can choose as you're going through the carousel. And then when you're finally decided, you pick the one you want. Because, I mean, if I pick this one here, I mean, if I go through another few carousels, and there could be a better one out there. Who knows? But what they're trying to say as well, if you pick this one, there's a very random chance that anybody else will have the exact kind of same looking character as that one. Well, I either like that, and I like her, I like the different coloured eyes on her. That's pretty cool. I think I'm actually... Ooh, I like that one as well. See, that's the, that's, the, that's the thing that's wrong with it. I like that one. I like that one. Her there. And I quite like him. I mean, if I choose him, he's... What I am styles yeah, look really cool on this one. This is going to be my pirate. I finally got her. She's the one I'm going to choose. But like I said, I would prefer to have a, a group of 10 maybe. And then I could probably go through them and have a good look. And just to sort of decide which one I prefer to pick. But I think she's, she'll do. So I am going to pick her. Yes, I am sure. There we go. But here we are in the game, and I'm going to have a proper look at my pirate. Let's go and have a little look outside. I think she looks pretty cool. Let's go down by the wall. Oh, it's got a thunderstorm coming up. And we'll have a little look. Let's get a better look at her. Yeah, she looks all right. I do like the eyes. The kind of red eye and the, the, the eye that looks sort of damaged. It's whited out. That looks pretty cool. Pretty good dancer as well. I mean, just look at that water. Doesn't that look cool? 
looks absolutely fantastic. What I want to do while I'm here as well is I want to check out the stores. So I heard they have put some different options in the stores. We'll go over here. This is the clothes store. Uh, see what kind of different things we have in. Hello, talk to Chris. Oh, this is new. You usually just brought up a list of things you could buy. Hello there, I'm Chris. Absolutely radiant in here today. Perhaps a little may even rub off on you. Browse Chris's stock. Any new stock in? Can you put me on the waiting list for new stock? Oh, that's pretty cool. Well, what would you recommend? Let's see what he says here. Oh, perhaps something in blue to accentuate that coldness in your stare. Maybe even green. Live up to the envy of yours. Live up to that envy of yours. Very good, yes. I even have a splash of playful red in here somewhere. I see you blushing. The point is, one can never have too much colour, especially with your appearance. Okay, so let's just have a look what he has in stock. There you go. Loads of different so got eye patches. You got like a scarf there. Looks like more like a bandage. Uh, a bilge rat eye patch. Oh, look, you can get the beards, peg legs, the hooks, different hairstyles, different facial hairs, different kind of trousers. That's not bad. So that's pretty different. Uh, the equipment store is this guy up here, I think. Yep. Okay, let's talk to Travis. Hello. Why not let old Travis here show you his very finest? Let's browse his stock. Yeah, basically this is just your your instruments, your bucket, your compass, your telescope, things like that, and your tankard. And you've also got lanterns. Uh, where's the weapon guy? That's the tavern. Is this the weapons guy over here? Okay, what brings you to Whitney's shop? What could you possibly want? Let's have a look. Okay, this is the weapons. You've got your Admiral Eye of Reach, which is quite a nice one. That's a nice color. Yeah, a couple of different pistols. Your blunderbuss. So they've added a little bit more to it. Oh, look at that thunder and lightning. This game does look absolutely beautiful. I mean, just look at the way the sun's just coming through that cloud over there. Din, 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 din. Right, I've got gold. It's 200. I can get this. Yeah, well, I haven't got any money anyway, so. Right, let's get sailing. Well, you're going faster with that big fat ass in the face. <laughs> right, um, stick your voyage over here, Kev. That's the same one as I've got. Mm, shouldn't be. Doesn't matter. Right, we've got two maps. We'll go for the top one. The very top one first. Okay. <clears throat> okay, let's have a look for that on the map table. And there it is there. Right south. The Isle of Lost Words. So when you go southeast. I've never been on one of these slips before, so ah, here it is. Right, southeast it is. These turn pretty nifty compared to the galleons, don't they? I think they're better, considerably quicker as well, if you go on this. Oh, there's a lot of rocks in that down here, though. At 
little bit more to the east, I think. I think I'll try and go through the um, this these two big rocks here through the middle. We're heading towards the storm, though. That should be cool. That's not it, there, is it? Hmm. Oh yeah, it is. That is it. Drop the anchor. Should have went a little bit closer, but no matter. Like I said, I've never been on one of these slips before, so I'm not sure how um, quickly it would stop, and you know what I mean, compared to the galleon. Took a while for the anchor to drop on that much. And there are sharks. <laughs> okay, so it looks like it's over here. I think. Let me check. Get the lay of the land. I think it's right around here somewhere. Oh, look at that. First hit. Surprised no skeletons have jumped up yet. Castaway's chest. Let's grab our booty. Or oh, what you want to do as well is check. There's a... I've seen a barrel somewhere. Check it and grab whatever's in it. Need to keep up on supplies. Alright, did you say you've seen sharks? No, I didn't say I'd seen sharks. I said, remember, there are sharks. Yeah, right, you go first. If you see any sharks, shoot them. Because <laughs> I can't shoot with this chest. Well, then, there's Nemo. I found him. And three of his mates. Okay, let's look for this next island. The funny shaped one. I think that's it there. Plunderer's Plight. So we've got to go... Yeah, that's it. Southwest. Uh, no, north. Northeast. Yeah, yeah. Damn, that uh, anchor comes up really quick, doesn't it? Yep. You might want to go, but I don't know whether you're uh, turning. Nah, I'm going to go around this first, then turn. It looks like there's quite a few things we have to navigate around. Okay, we've caught the wind, that's good. I'll tell you what I want to do as well, is turn these lanterns off at night time. That's better, stealth mode. <laughs> going the way you're going. Uh, there should be an island up to our right if you stay to the left hand side of that and keep going. Right, okay. Well there's three islands in front of me I can see. Well go to the left hand side of this one on your right. Okay. 
Well, the big one. Yeah, the one on the right hand side now, the port. Yep. That is right, isn't it? Port's right, starboard's left, yeah? No. <laughs> ah, it's the other way around, isn't it? Yes, starboard's right, port's left. Starboard's right, port's left. Yep, want to go past this, keep going. I think I can see it right in front, the way you're heading right now, I can see an island right ahead of us. I think that's the one where we need to go to. Right, okay, I can't hold up. Uh, quite a good distance ahead of us, so good, good bit away. I'll have a look in the crow's nest. Land ahoy! <laughs> the island we're going for, is that the one with the trees on? Yep. And I'll get ready to drop the anchor. Want to get just a little bit closer. Check the map. It seems to be right in the centre, it looks like. Drop the anchor now, now, Jim. Oh, we have mm. skeletons. Oh, I forgot. Um, can we get the sniper rifle on that from in here? I think we can, yes. can we? Yes. Right, equipment. It's not that. It's where's the where's the bloody thingy on this up here? Ah, here it is, yeah. You know what? Uh, one of us is probably better with a sniper rifle and one of us is probably better with a blunderbuss, would you reckon? I've got the blunderbuss. Right, I'll get the sniper then. It's just so, I mean, if we come up against other ships, uh, one of us can try it like, from a distance and one of us up close, you know what I mean? Okay. <laughs> Let's try and take some of these buggers out. Right, there's one smack in the centre. There's one just over by this rock as well. They need to up the sensitivity of these sniper rifles because I've actually turned my mouse sensitivity down a touch because it's way too sensitive just in the normal movement. Yeah. With a sniper rifle, it's really slow. Right, that's them gone. I'm just gonna get some more ammo. Oops, another skeleton in here. Got it, yeah. Yes, anyway. Right, can you another skeleton? Where is he? Here he is. Come here, you little bugger. I want to see how the blocking. Yeah, that's not bad. Blocking's pretty cool. Okay, let's go. Right, do you want to choose that mission? One table here. So it's the same mission that you had, but it'll be on a different island. Okay. Okay. Oh, it looks like we've got another map. Oh no, same one. Alright, let's have a look. Right. That? Try Rock Isle? It certainly looks like it. Yep, that's, that's it. Right in front of yep, so straight south then. Oh, 
That one's too slow. I like the fast ones. This one. I like this one. I tell you what, it'll be good once you get the, the full game and you get them big ghost skull that comes up over the island and it's every ship on the server can see it. Yeah. That's, that's going to be cool. What happens then, you actually go towards that island and it actually spawns tons and tons of skeletons and there's like a boss skeleton and once you kill the boss skeleton there's loads of treasure you to, to pick up but there's too much treasure for one crew to pick up so there, there's going to be fighting you're all going to be fighting to get the treasure and there's not enough for you to take it on one ship you'll have to go back to get more yeah that's it right there to our left or the island yeah Right, I'm going to turn right as we get close to it, Jim, so we side on. Right, are you ready? Um, when you want to drop the anchor, mate, it's up to you. Now we'll do. Okay, it's on the north side. Which is the side we came up on, I think. So it's just over here. I think it's just behind these rocks. Oh, skeleton. Any more? Right, I think we better head to outpost with Dragon. Yeah, it's alright for you because you were playing this char that character yesterday. You've got gold. I ain't got any gold at all yet <laughs> on this character. What's that? We've got three chests. That's the one. <laughs> Yeah, you have to stop and then play again when it starts. Yeah. I mean, it's That's the um, Flight of the Valkyries, isn't it, this one? I think so, yeah. Is it the Flight of the Valkyries? Right, you need to go left of this big island ahead of us. It's a very quiet sea, I tell you. No ships at all. I haven't seen yet. Mind you, if everyone was having the same problem we had logging on. Yeah, I was reading the forums, a lot of people were moaning about not being able to go on, but it's it's a bloody scale test they're doing, it's not a beta, you know what I mean? It's They're, they're trying to stress the servers out, that's exactly what they're trying to do. Which is a good thing, I mean, they've had loads of these scale tests, they've had loads of betas, so I think they're doing it right, getting everything ready for the, 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 the proper launch, if you know what I mean. Oh, look at that sunrise, wow, that's bright, damn. And you start selling shades in the shop. <laughs> we well, get patch. Yeah, but it's only going to cover one eye, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> Your one still cracks me up. A female with a moustache, because I mean, she has. She looks. She's got tits and a moustache. That's just wrong, wrong, really wrong. Come on, it's pirates. I don't shave. Yeah, you might get a, a little bit of hair in that top lip, but not that. That's a full-grown freaking moustache. That is. I hope they had um, more like pirate shanties and that, you know what I mean? Yeah. Different songs and that. Well, you, uh, you, ever, you played um, Assassin's Creed Black Flag, didn't you? Yes. Uh, see when you used to go on a pirate ship with that and they actually they would actually sing the proper shanties? I, I thought that was freaking awesome. Right, I'm going to raise this sail up so it should slow us down coming in towards here. Yeah, look at that, spot on.
Uh, we've got one more, haven't we? I think so, yeah. We've got three. Yeah. We should actually come up there and tell you here, I think. I think it's on about seven, eight, something like that. Yeah, because mine isn't. I'm only on one at the moment. I haven't even reached two yet. Crazy dog at it again. The skeletons, there's loads of them. There's another one. Let's see the block does. Watch. Oh, I was going to block him. All right, okay. Mate. That's quite a lot of them that time, isn't there? You ready to hit the anchor? Ew. I think he misjudged that one. <laughs> right, we've got a few holes. Thinking it's up that half there on the second level, I reckon. Oh shit, we've got another sloop up there. Another what, sorry? Another ship. Should we bank a move? Yeah, they're gonna sink our ship. They shooting it. Yeah, they're shooting at the ship. Shit, I've run out of fucking ammo. Quick, back to the ship. Patch, I'll bail. Mm -hmm. Ah, we're going under. Motherfuckers! I'm gonna leave that shit before I come back. Quick, lift the anchor. Where you going, mate?
Wait for me! There you go, mate. I'll drop the anchor. Right, they'll be coming back, Kev, so be careful. Just put that down there. <laughs> <laughs> I'll teach you. Uh, next to the mermaid. Get rid of your sword. <laughs> yeah, both ships sank, look. <laughs> Oh, yeah, uh, look, at, look at the chests sitting here as well. Look. Another thing is, when you go back to your ship, you can't take a chest with you. Yeah, I seen that barrel on the the the, the, the sand. I thought, fuck it, I'm gonna go and get it and sink their ship. <laughs> 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 I bet they weren't expecting that. <laughs> Yeah, that was quite good. Um, killed both of them anyway, twice. That was quite good. I enjoyed that. So there you go. Some Sea of Thieves. Pretty slow night, but some good action right at the end of that. I don't think they were very experienced, because why would they come back and come that close to us? They knew we would come and come down towards the ship. Yeah. And for them not to be looking for us to board the ship, I think they were a bit inexperienced, but... Oh well, killed both of them. I mean, we could have got away stealing the ship, but it was near the end of the night anyway. I just wanted to grab that barrel and blow the shit out of it. <laughs> right, yeah, I enjoyed that. Yep, so there you go guys. Some Sea of Thieves, some good action right at the end. Don't forget, if you like the content, hit that like button, and I will catch us again next time.